Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. When you are a president, when you are in government, everyone in that country is under you. You treat them like your children. That's why you can have children in, in, in the house. They want to oppose you. They want to fight you. They want to insult you. Do you kill them for insulting you? No. You still manage them. That's why you can have children that are armed robbers. Children that are smoking weed. But they are still your children. You still take care of them. How can a city minister threaten violence and is not arrested? How on earth? Hmm? How on earth? Eh? GBM is talking. GBM talk from the Tami. That one I can understand him. He done here. Nothing. Somebody who was beating the wife. Is he also when that one talk, who must take him serious? The brain is here. That's why the Tami is big. The brain is not here. The brain is here. How can you say Bembaland is a no-go area? <laughs> you are in government. You are, you are speaking such type of a thing. You want to destroy Zambia. You want to divide Zambia. You are in government. You are in government for Christ's sake. You are in government for God's sake. Hmm? And you want to destroy Zambia. This place is a no-go area. Why? You know, you people are in government. You are the one that's supposed to be in forefront, uniting the nation. But you are the same people that send your cadres to go to radio station and fight disrupt HH program. You are the one that started the fight. Eh? What Edgar Lungu will you sit down with this your idiots and sit them down and 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 hear them, you know, I and hear them and hear them speak. You know, mm -hmm. sit them down and tell them how to rule a nation. Those guys are fools. They don't understand anything. That's why they have destroyed Zambia completely. None of them in PF. There is no single intellectual. Everyone is a cadre. You know, they are looking for what to get. They loot this, they stand outside the country. They loot this, they send outside the country. They loot this, they send outside the country. That's why they are filthy rich. Rich idiots. Rich fools. You know, rich people that don't have anything on their head. People that think from their stomach. Eh? What are you talking about? GBM, you, it's, it's, a, it's a disgrace for a grown man like you to stand up and say, eh, hey, for that, UPND, I declare Bembaland no good area for you. In Bembaland, you are nobody. You are not even a heavyweight. You were beating up and down, beating left and right, beating like a stupid idiot by the time you were with HH. Your daughter, your own daughter, did not even win. Of all the whole money you were flashing without brain. Eh? I even heard you. Eh, I, I'm the one who was spending money. HH uh, was not spending any money. If you store money, if you get money easily, you will spend it easily. If you work hard for it, it will be hard for you to spend it. HH is not like you that got a contract because you are in government. HH worked at, he has never been in government and is rich. Don't expect, him, don't expect him to spend it the way you are spending. Because you got your own through government contract and all that useless things. You know? These are the things that who 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 advises PF? Who advises Eddie Galung? Eddie Galung is gallivanting up and down, he's jumping from here to here, wasting time for nothing. If he had an advisor, he was not even going to be wasting time. I'm telling you. He was not going to be wasting time campaigning. Election is still far. Eddie Galungu does not understand that the brain of Zambian people have shifted. Even if the way you like stealing things. Even if you go and steal Dubai, I'm telling you, and paste it in Zambia. Everyone in Zambia is working in Dubai. They will still not vote you because they now know that your leadership is corrupt. And they know that you protect corrupt people 
they know that you love corruption. That's why they will not vote for you. And corruption destroys the nation. Corruption destroys everything. Corruption is a destroyer. You know? Corruption is a destroyer. Corruption, corruption is a nation destroyer. Eh? How on earth? Edgar Lung is, is ruling Zambia like Zambia is his, uh, his kitchen. Eh? Fake report has been brought to you. Sir, release the fixed report. There are people that were mentioned in that report that are corrupt. Why are you protecting them? And you say you are not corrupt. People are saying, oh, Edgar Lung is not corrupt. You don't know. Edgar Lung is not corrupt. He, he is corruption himself. Release the fake report. The, those, guys, those, those people are getting salary for finding criminals. Those people are getting salary for preparing those reports. They have prepared the report and gave to you. Release it. You can release it. And why do you actually think that Zambia people will vote for you again? When you are protecting criminal and corruption. That's why I call you the Jagaban of corruption. The Jagaban of corruption. That's what you are. Zambian people, let me tell you something as I conclude and start taking your question. Zambia is going to be great again. It's very simple. Zambia is so blessed. Zambia has a lot of money. You know, Zambia has millions. Zambia has billions. Zambia has everything. What Zambia has lacked is leadership. When you see a leadership where the racility is part of that leadership, know that that, that that government has come to loot. When you see a leadership where you see Boman Lusambo is there, Know that that government is full of bootlickers. It's government of idiots. There is no intellectual in PF. They have run down the country completely. The country is on its knee right now. I am praying that you are watching me from Luapula. Or you are watching me from Lusaka. You have people in Luapula. You have people in, in, in all the places that they call their stronghold. Start talking to them in advance. I have even seen how those people that are getting NRS, how they will turn around and vote for HH instead of Ed Galungu. In Ed Galungu's stronghold, mark my word, next year, start telling them, Zambia belongs to Zambian people. There is nothing like Bemba. There is nothing like, uh, there is nothing like uh, uh, Lozi. There is nothing like uh, Tonga. Zambia is one. Someone must take over Zambia and they bring back the glory of Zambia. Someone must take over Zambia and take care of Zambia. If you have watched me today, you hate me, you know, you hate CR1 because you're a PF cadre. Have I lied? If I have lied, I lied, I lied the lie that I've lied. Let me explain. I don't lie. You can hate me for being a Satanist, which you say I am, which I'm not. You can hate me for saying I don't, I'm not a Christian. I have freedom of worship. I worship what I want. You can hate me for any other thing. But one thing you will not hate me for is truth. I say the truth. No matter who you are, I tell you the truth. Because the Bible that you read as a Christian says, we shall know the truth. And the truth shall set us free. You can hate me for the spiritual work I'm doing. Maybe when I was in Zambia, uh, I killed someone that was related to you or I harmed someone that was related to you or I did something that affected you. You can hate me for all those things. But you cannot hate me because of the truth because I speak the truth. I say the truth. I don't lie. I say the truth because I believe in the truth. I believe in the truth. If you are following this page, I say, Jagaban, we do not lie. We tell you the truth without fear and favor. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Savage. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutati Mpondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.